So on this problem, we're trying to find the percentile for a frequency distribution. And in this case, you really just need to be focusing on the first column, which this is where you're going to get your answers from, and the last column, because this, the cumulative frequency, is basically your percentiles. So we needed these, the frequency and relative frequency, to get this column, but you can kind of ignore these to answer the question. So if I'm looking for the um, 63rd percentile, which you're going to go over here and um, notice that you've got 55 right here and 66 right here. So this at four times that they floss per week ends at 55%. And so five times per week is everything after 55% up to 66%. So in this case, um, your 63% is going to fall inside the 5 times per week. So your P of 63 is going to equal 5. Um, now there's other types of questions where if I said P of 55, notice 55 is where this one ends. When you get in that situation, if where it ends, you're going to split it between this and the next one. So you're going to go halfway between 4 and 5. So P of 55 would be 4.5. Um, the same thing if I said the 25th percentile would be 1.5. Or if I said the 80th percentile, that would be 6.5. So if it lands on, if I'm asking you for um, exactly this percentile, you go between the classes, but if it falls within, in this case, 63, that's inside of the five times per week. So if I said um, 32, that would be two times per week. So I hope that explains getting the percentiles from frequency distributions a little bit better.